We begin tonight with a bomb scare that caused the evacuation of a shopping center in Portland. It was right around noon when Portland police were notified of the suspicious item that had been placed on top of a dumpster behind the peerless cleaners off Highway 181. Luckily, it turned out to be a fake. Bill Churchwell spoke with the employee, vowed it, joins us now with the story. Quite a twist to it, doesn't it? Quite the twist, Rudy. We got a good look at that device that was found. It looked pretty real. It even had a clock attached to it. After an investigation, it turned out there was no threat at all. Um, I had a customer come and tell me that there was something weird looking on top of a dumpster. This is a picture of what Phyllis Bound discovered outside of her job at Peerless Cleaners. Sitting on top of a dumpster, what appeared to be six pieces of dynamite taped together. It even had a clock attached to it. It caused enough alarm, she decided to call Portland police. I guess they thought it looked real enough that uh, they called the bomb squad. Emergency crews descended on the scene. Businesses in the Crescent Shopping Center were evacuated and entrances were blocked off as a precaution, all happening during the lunchtime hour. Secured the area. CCPD came over. Uh, well, they will send their robot in. This is a look at that robot in action. Portland Police Chief Mark Corey said because the department does not have its own bomb squad, they were able to give CCPD a call thanks to a good partnership, and the response was quick. A great relationship, uh, especially to have that assistance from the larger department that has those assets that are immediately available to them. But after an investigation, it was determined the device turned out to be a fake. In today's time, you have to take every, uh, every call as serious as possible. While the device did not pose a threat, it was taken as evidence as police began their search for the person responsible, a person that could have faced felony charges. But then there was a twist. After gaining attention on social media, a person came forward after recognizing the device as a replica gag gift she threw away a couple of days ago while cleaning the house. Authorities also say they got a call from a person who saw someone dumpster diving, taking the item out of that dumpster and placing it right on top. <laughs> so mystery solved yeah. there. And of course, police say if you throw anything out in the trash that even resembles a bomb to dismantle it, just take it apart. Yeah, then you can throw it away. There you go. All right, Bill Churchwell, thanks a lot for that.